Hey guys, this is Balu from Balu Prime and once again welcome you all back for an exciting tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show how we can create this kind of videos in Adobe After Effects using Element 3D plugin easily. So hope you guys will find this tutorial useful but before going to that if you end up liking this video, please click on that like button to share this content and if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing my channel and support. And by the way, if you like short 3D simulation videos, you can check out my second channel, link in the description. So now without any further ado, let's start today's video. So here we are in After Effects. Now let's start this by importing our footage onto this project panel. So for that right click on this project panel, import select your file or else you can directly drag and drop your footage onto this project panel. So now again select your footage and drop it onto this composition icon here so that it creates a composition with the footage properties. Okay. So here I got this footage. So I will trim this video. So I will make the beginning frame from here. So press B on the keyboard for beginning frame and let me move forward in timeline to find the end frame. So at this frame, I want to end this video. So press N on the keyboard, right click, trim, come to work area. So now let's track this footage first. So for that, select this footage layer in timeline, go to this window and enable tracker from here and click on this track camera. So it starts analyzing our footage and gives us some tracking points when it is done. So here you can see our tracking is done and we got some track points here. Okay, so now let's hold left mouse key and select all these track points here like this and now right click and create solid in camera. So here we got a solid created. So now if I press zero on the keyboard, you can see we got this track solid. Let me reduce the scaling. So press S and reduce the scaling here like this and let me see this. So now you can see this track solid is following this perspective change everything here. Nice. So let me apply a grid effect. So let me go to this effects and presets and let me look into grid. So let me select this grid and drop it onto this track solid. This is not necessary just to check the tracking. I am doing this one. So now if I play this, you can see our track solid is staying in its position firmly. Nice. So now let's create a solid layer for element 3D. So go to this layer options, new create a solid. Let me rename this as element. Make it of comp size and hit OK. So now come to this effects and presets panel. If you're not finding this panel here, go to this window and enable effects and presets and then look for element. So select this element and drop it onto this element layer and now click on the scene setup button. So here we got a new window open to work in element 3D. So now let me import a TV model here, television model. So go to this import and let me select the file. So this is the model and import OK. So alignment let it be from bottom so that our model comes above to this grid and hit OK. So here we got our model. So now click on this normalize size. So you can see we got our model here. So now right click box animation set it to channel one. So now let's change the environment. So here I got a screenshot of the same video. So actually we need a 360 image. So since I don't have that image, I will be using a screenshot. So let me go to this environment and let me select that image. So here I got the screenshot of this video. So let's select it and open. So it will be updated here. So now if I click on this environment tab, we are in the same environment here. Nice. So now let me hide this one and click on this OK button. So here we got our 3D model. So let me move to the starting frame here. So here we need to copy the position of this track solid to this element. So before to that, let me select this element layer. Come to this group one. Since it is in group one, we need to work in group one. So come to this create group null and click on this create button. So here we got a group null created. So now we need to copy the position of this track solid to this group null. So select this track solid, press P on the keyboard, select this position values, go to this edit, copy, select this group null, press P on the keyboard, select this position and paste. So now we got this TV model set to that position. Now we need to adjust the position and scaling. So let me head out this track solid, select this element layer. So this is in group one aux channel one. So we are in group one, come to this aux channel, aux channel one. Now let me increase the scaling and let me rotate this here. So I will rotate this here in Y axis and position. Let me place this here. Okay. So if I move forward in timeline here, we need to adjust the Z axis. So let me change the position of Z axis here like this. And also let me increase the scaling. So now if I move to starting frame, so now we need to adjust this position. So let me move it here, position and let me make it adjustment. Okay. So if I play this now, you can see we got this television model onto the human character. 
So in this way, we can create this kind of videos in Adobe After Effects using Element 3D plugin easily. So hope you guys have learned something new from this tutorial. If you learned anything new, please like, share and subscribe my channel to support me. So we'll meet in the next video. Until then, signing off. Take care. Bye.